Tell him the that bars was, that you like. He gonna laugh at you. Tell him the bars. Oh, you like. like the why? No. Why? Actually, I was gonna skip all that because we talked about it already. I was just just gonna. Um, oh, damn. I actually wrote down my favorite Drake disses. Drake. So. I was gonna see. I was gonna do the the uh, the the. Oh, lyric, so that's the where you want to go. Okay, yeah, okay. I was gonna break down every. Go drink ahead. Well, then, what if I, okay, you so, over? You segue like you wanted to have an open. Or y'all can tell me what y'all think it is, or who this is, who this is about. Oh, go ahead, go ahead, yeah, 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 go ahead. Okay, Kanye. Let's, right. let's start with red. Right, no. <laughs> let's start with red, red, red button. Okay. Definitely Kanye. Leave your label devastated, even when your your pad in the stats, even when you pad the stats. Period. I never hate it. That might that. You know what? That might be just a broad stroke. I don't know. I don't got. I ain't got nobody coming. Like, yeah, I don't know. This who you? Who you got? This, this is definitely. This definitely a Kanye West bar. Yeah, but I don't. You yeah, pass yeah. that it. Because so. right after this, um, uh, Def Jam had cut ties with Kanye, pushed a step down as the president of Good Music. So and that all happened way before. But they yeah. but they padded the numbers on. Um, y'all remember the life of Pablo? Yeah. Title inflated his numbers gotcha. when that album had released so he and he also wrote uh what was it on that one he did well he helped with, out with 30 hours yeah he helped out with um with father stretch my hand mm -hmm. so yeah. you know leave your label devastated even when you pat the stats i never hate it okay. so that's yeah and then well i was right there from the beginning i just said kanye because usually these days that nigga he just want to box kanye. in fact this whole song yeah. was like kanye. i want to say that's why i'm like kanye it gotta be okay uh, okay every time you need me for a boost yeah, kanye. i never hesitated um every time that yeezy called a truce he had my head inflated thinking we would finally get to piece it up and, levitate. and, and get to levitate and re realize that everything premeditated so we already know yeah, that's what i'm saying like, okay, okay but 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 the play on words did y'all catch the plays yeah, it's all the right, what's the play i know tim though it's all the, no i don't really have much oh, to okay, say, okay okay but uh, i just know well the boost like the yeah, easy yeah, boost yeah. which it's i all, thought was like it's all was the like right, cool it's yeah, all it's the nice, right. they're like they're like truce the, the 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 dope part of that song to me was the levitation mm -hmm. like the song lift me up yeah. levitation that shit was that that shit was dope. I I like that. I don't know if I don't, know, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. That nigga pin was that. We this, piece this, it up and get to levitating, like lift me up, and then what he did with the. the that's what that was for. Okay. That, yo, that nigga. He does his thing. He Drake, he, he within, be having some Jay Z. These extra six tracks he said within those tracks that how how precise and meticulous he's, Bro, he is when it comes to everything. Okay. This this next one. Um, I'll give you a hard pill to swallow. This your medication. I will fucking pop your ass like a revelation, or I'll pop up in your pop, ass pop like up, a revelation. Yeah, pop up on your ass. Pop yeah, up on your yeah, ass yeah, like a revelation. Yeah, yeah. I know the bar. Oh, yeah. mm -hmm. I, I can tell you yeah. better than I show you. This a demonstration. I will fucking leave you in the dirt. That's some vegetation. Chemicals is mixing in my brain and killing hesitation. I will fucking face a few shots like a vaccination. Whatever. Okay. The point is, force a few shots like a vaccine. force a few yeah, shots. Yeah. That, that's that's an easy one. Yeah, no, yeah. I'm saying we, we, got, we got the yeah. backs one. Yeah, we got yeah. The vegetation one was dope because mm -hmm. of that easy video. You remember what he did yep. with the yep. with the game? Yeah. yeah, that that shit was dope. And uh, me medication. I mean, because he's bipolar, oh, he was yeah. taking that medication, yeah. Yeah. which was actually kind of kind of cool because um, hard pill to swallow. He like like con like Kanye said at some point. He stopped taking his his medication because it was fucking with his creativity. Yep. So I thought that that was like kind of dope. This, this nigga really was kind of surgical with the bars. Like so, a lot of that shit was really really nice. So can, can I just real quick? Can I say something? Mm -hmm. So I get it. Do you know the one thing I don't get about this? What? To what end? Right. Like so we get the um what was the shit with off uh Travis Scott album right? We got the what was it called? Fiend. No, the, with him the Drake. Oh. Um, got everybody all. Like in a in a what, what, I forget what it's called. Meltdown. Meltdown, right? So we get that we get all this shit and it's just like it's been so long. It's like to what end? Like the bars is hot, but like You know what it is without though? the name without him Nigga, responding. This shit is never gonna end. But, yeah, but without him responding, like what's the point? Oh, fuck that. The thing is though, we all again, we skipped a whole <laughs> bunch, but we talked about the album and yeah. we know we heard the critiques, we know what everybody said about this album. After that happened, yeah. that hyped him up. And then this so yeah, but he just like it's like overkill. Like you already beat the. It's nigga. not overkill. No, it's not. It's not. Yeah. Stories about my brother. Imagine us getting our validation from an ex musician Joe searching buddy. for recognition. Your buddy. Yeah, Joe, buddy. Joe Buttons. Yeah, we know that. And and you know what? And I didn't like that either. But same like story every time. They heckling in repetition. So it's like everyone who always talks shit, nigga. I'm addressing it. So yeah, would you? Nah, though. But no. So remember when it was more? He was 
more like um he wouldn't just address everybody. Like remember when he was like more on the Jay Z blueprint. You'll never hear a reply for it. Yeah, yeah that that's the dra- like what Jay Z. Jay Z don't want you after, can't after after. after so five, so what are you saying? Years, like like, like, Joe, like, but, like why so, is he addressing it? So it's not even that. And and so it kind of make you look like 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 Kevin Durant on Twitter like. Every critic, you don't have to attack. Oh, he's, he's addressing it because there's truth in what's being said. I, did, I think that too. I don't think Joe Budden even hated on the album. Joe Budden didn't like it, and 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 you know what? No, actually, yeah. From what I when I when and I Joe Budden's a fan. Episode, he's yeah, a big fan. He is. But he's a big he, fan. He was hard on him, but it's because he expects more from him. No, it's not. Oh, it was that. It was the academics clip. Academics well, made well, a clip, and when he did that clip about him fucking twenty five year olds. And I told you what I said about Jaded. I told y'all what I said about Jaded. This nigga is next is the next R. Kelly, but I'm gonna stop there. I'm gonna stop there. Who's the next R. Kelly? Oh, y'all niggas, go can't. back and listen. This ain't even one of them topics yeah, that niggas talk about. No, go back and listen to Jaded. That nigga was 28. She was 18. Georgia Smith. This nigga had some R. Kelly type bars on. Who, there. Wait, who? What? Drake. I'm the only person I fuck who ever who ever said did, did this shit. I've never heard anybody else say it. I mean, I'm gonna probably cut this part out. Is that a legal age in London? <laughs> well, <laughs> depending on the time zone, he might have been legit. What I'm saying is, this nigga was getting mad about a 25 year old. Yeah. Like, wait, who's fucking George Smith? It's not Drake was. Drake was okay. But, she was, but think about it like this. He's saying there's some truth to it. When Drake, damn, from called, 18 oh, to 28, Hill. when this nigga was when this nigga was 18, she was 10. There's a difference between being like, let's say, like somebody being 30 and you dating someone who's 39. It's the maturity level. Okay. So if you're talking to a girl who just got legal, yeah. that looks like grooming, it looks predatory. It got so when you listen to a song like Jaded, go back and break down the bars, it seems okay. a little bit. I kept thinking you were saying Jaded, and I'm like, Jade, what was the it? song Jaded. Jaded. Okay. Yes, okay. From, okay. from Scorpion. So now. Yeah, that nigga Drake says she old enough to cross the street. She old enough to get hit. <laughs> so now, but, but now you fast forward it to now with that, he got really offended by that bar too. So that, yeah. But it's like he Touched said, nerve. you can't use 25 or whatever Drake said. Like, you can't make the excuse of being 25. That excuse of me just doesn't fly. Nigga. When he, when you're saying this shit, you, I even kind of ignored that bar too. I even mm. ignored it. But then the next bar, like two bars later, he how, says old is, about, how old is Joe Budden? Uh, 40, 42. Like 40 42. 42. His yeah. girlfriend's 27. Is she? Is she? Is she? Is she? Is she? I don't know. No, I don't know about that. Yeah, I, I don't know about that. And I, I hope you fact check that because yeah, 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 yo. I don't make you. I, no, for real. I'll have to go back and change it. <laughs> They can make sure you know them numbers when you say that. Yeah, that's they, deep. Yeah. But even if that's the case, Joe Budden's not not the one who has who's writing this record. Okay, so and also so it only you're bringing it up about it's one only, person. It it's, only matters. No, it's only it Bobby, only no, yeah, it only matters when you're the one getting offended when it's addressed. That's okay. when it matters. That's when it matters. Right. And then, yeah, you, because that, if that, I never that, if that I never res, if I never responded, the thing wouldn't be highlighted. Now I do think that it's gross. About th- this is nothing like like nobody said that, but. I personally think that's gross when I hear the song Jaded and then I think about Georgia Smith and I think about the age difference. No one else has said this before. I'm the only one who said that as far as I know. Nobody else ever addressed that. I thought that that shit was a weirdo shit. Me personally, and you you confirmed, validated that it was about Georgia. You you confirmed. absolutely uh, he probably put it. Ab- yeah, no, mean, no, it's no, he a, confirmed it. It's so, absolutely okay. that it, Trust me, I, if I I wouldn't have said it if I wasn't sure. Joe Bur- 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 for thirty seven, but go ahead. Thirty seven. Yeah, oh, okay. yeah. But I hear you. Now that's a now yeah, see, that's yeah. a big but yeah. but what I'm saying is like if you were a, if you were eighteen and you were dating a girl who was fourteen. Yeah, that's Tim, we gonna look at you fucking crazy, bro. Say Tim because I'm not Tim gonna look at you crazy. Look at yourself. Yeah. Now, uh, now I'm saying if she was 34 and you're 38, even though the time is the same, the immaturity, the maturity, it's yes. very different. So, life so when Drake was saying that, I understand what he was trying to say because then he, his next bar says she's 21. He was, he was making a song, but I don't think he was really thinking about the bars being analyzed. It's the same thing it's not that he being, did with the scissor bar. It's the same thing. Yeah, yeah he was. It, it wasn't supposed to be broken down. Basically, is what yeah, he was, was a, saying. It was a throwaway bar. But then he said, I'll "Don't make that. me look like this." But it's like, nigga, you put yourself you in that yourself position. Like that. Okay. That's really what he was addressing yeah. when he was saying that, and also the the J Cole thing. He kind of addressed that too. What? Like he was, he didn't like that. that. Must be the key ingredient. He didn't like that. Talking about that, yeah. Yeah, he didn't like that shit whatsoever. But I, <laughs> I'm gonna be honest. The, when I heard the first song, First Person Shooter, yeah. and I am a big J. Cole fan, yeah. 
Yeah. I thought Drake verse was better than J. Cole verse. Mm -hmm. no, first person shooter? I thought that. You, you on board with that? Shooter. You on board with that? No, actually. Yeah. Right. His, uh, I, J. Cole's delivery and everything. Like, yeah. But you know, when I, when I thought that, I was thinking from the perspective of if I was to go to a concert and I was to actually hear this at a festival, a stadium, somewhere where we're trying to turn up, I felt like J. Cole's verse was subpar. Like, for example, uh, J., J. Cole has um, no role models. Lyrically, that song to me, if you just read the lyrics, is fucking whack. It's What's whack, turning? right? That's a good song, though. But exactly. So I felt like in a situation where we're playing this song, J. Cole decided to go one route with it, which yeah. is he gonna borrow. Don't like lyrically when you look at it written down, it was dope. When you hear sonically how it sounds and you're in the environment where we're trying to turn up. I no, thought Drake's verse was better. No, that shit was still no. Yeah. That verse I thought it was better. Yeah, no, that's that verse was still out of this. But then, but then, it, I mean. It, I see what you mean, like, well, Drake is that, that mass appeal type flow, but ain't nobody come for that for Jake. Wouldn't it, you know, you're J. Cole. That's just a Drake. I, 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 I ain't trying really to. a mass appeal flow, it's just Drake. Yeah, like, yeah, that's just Drake. Yeah, but, but you know, but Drake, yeah. he but know how both, to do it in a way. And like, well, for me personally, it, even when everybody was like saying that, I understood why they said it was better. Yeah. But at the same I, time, damn. I was like, and? That, that you know what I'm saying? I wouldn't have cared. But then I could tell all the critiques that came out, he didn't like that. Like, oh, don't get me start. I, yo, I'm gonna say.